He's one of the greatest entertainers of all time. Now, Michael Jackson's unique artistry comes to San Francisco as MJ the Musical, centered around the making of the 1992 Dangerous World Tour. To tell us more are the cast members of MJ the Musical, Jamal Fields Green and Josh Dawson. Jamal, Josh, thank you both so much for joining us thank today. Thank you so much for having us. Yeah, yeah. having us. This is like <laughs> ecstatic, the MJ Musical. So many super fans of Michael Jackson out there. I'm a big fan as well. But for our viewers who maybe never heard of the musical, give us all the details of what it's about. Uh, okay, well, uh, MJ the Musical covers the final two days of the Dangerous Tour. It's 1992, um, and it's the final two rehearsal days of the Dangerous Tour, MTV comes into the building to interview Michael, and through the interview, we kind of go through, back through time from the Jackson 5 to Thriller up wow. until present day, 1992, uh, of that point. And without giving any spoilers, that's, uh, that's the gist of the musical. That's the gist of it. Oh my <laughs> gosh. It. And it sounds like it's encompassing pretty much everything, it right? Does. All of the yeah. highlights of Michael of Jackson's course, of career. Course. So when it comes to your specific roles, Josh, tell me about what you do. Sure. In the, musical. Uh, in the musical, I play Quincy Jones and Tito Jackson, uh, one of Michael's brothers. And Michael had a really unique relationship with each one of his brothers. Tito was the, the musician of the family. Um, yeah, and just really, like I said, we don't want to give too much away, but it <laughs> just course. really explores the humanity yeah. of all of these people. And I love really that. excited to share it with you all. Well, we're excited to learn <laughs> a few more details. <laughs> Cheers. And what about you, Jamal? What is your role specifically? Uh, I play MJ. Uh huh. Uh, You're like MJ. him. I'm yeah, but, him. <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm him. I guess. <laughs> I'm really active. Yeah, <laughs> but I play. I play MJ. Uh, I guess I don't, I don't think it gets any more. I was going to say, that's pretty self right? Really, yeah, for sure, yeah. for sure. So when people come to the show, right, and I know you, you can't give too much away, but the overall feel, right, especially for Michael Jackson fans, sure. super fans, I should say, mm -hmm. what can they expect when they walk through the doors? Sure. Uh, it's, it's about the dancing. It's about the music, the combination of both of those two things. We can promise a night at the theater, like, people have never expected. It's not mm -hmm. a traditional musical. It's more a concert. It's more a, oh. a, a glimpse of a, a singular moment. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. Okay, I like that too. So sure. it's kind of concert-esque, but there's still more storylines involved, sure. it sounds like. Totally. You know, it's, it's definitely a party, but uh, one of my favorite things about the musical is um, we really get a glimpse of the human being behind the icon. Mm. Uh, you know, he was such this big figure, still is this big figure in the world to all of us, you know, mm -hmm. who isn't a Michael Jackson fan? Mm -hmm. But uh, with this story, I think um, the way that it was written, Lynn Nottage wrote a very, very uh, impeccable uh, book. But um, with this story, one of the things that stick out to me is that we really get to, if you know a lot about MJ, you'll leave learning a little bit more. But really, uh, like I said, we kind of learn about the human being behind mm. this juggernaut of, uh, of an artist, of a per of a performer, everything. Yeah. yeah. And really, what does it mean to the two of you personally to be able to take part in really such a historical performance, I would say, because, I mean, MJ, we're talking Michael Jackson. So what does it mean for you? Sure. I mean, uh, Quincy Jones is a, he's a dream. Uh, he's an icon for me. So to be able to, to play this man uh, in connection with Michael Jackson, who's also an icon of mine, it's, it feels like a dream come true. I feel like I'm sort of in a Quincy Jones era of my life. And, I love that. Uh, I like music. I'm a musician as well. And so to be able to just be myself, I feel like this is a show that I can be the most authentic on stage. Wow. And that's a, a wonderful feeling as an actor. And what about for you? You know, is there any type of pressure playing the role of Michael Jackson? <laughs> um, totally, of course. You know, um, with this, you know, it's not like we're, we're playing... I think for all of us, you know, we're not playing characters that were built from the ground up. Like these are mm -hmm. actual people. Mm -hmm. So like legacies are in our hands, you know, for yeah. those for that duration of time that we're on stage. I mean, so there is definitely pressure. But with me, I mean, I grew up a big Michael Jackson fan. You know, I, I did Beat It, Thriller, You Rock My World in my living room with my grandpa as my DJ for my family growing up. <laughs> That's so cool. Um, so it's very honor. It's, it's, it's an honor. It's very humbling. Mm -hmm. um, the pressure comes with that. But I mean, I think if you do the work, and if you engulf yourself in the space and continue to strive for the artistry that Michael was and, and in doing that, honoring his legacy, mm -hmm. the pressure kind of goes away and it's more so just the fun and just the, it's more of a responsibility, mm -hmm. if anything. That's you know? beautiful. Yeah. So give us all the details. When and where can people catch this musical? So you can catch us at the Orpheum Theater playing now through February 25th. Oh, wonderful. Yes. Dates, so from now until February 25th. Yes. And is it one one show a night? Is that how it goes? Uh, we have 
two shows on Wednesday, two on Saturday. Uh, we are dark on Monday. That's the only day where there will not be shows. Mm -hmm. But other than that, it's a party. Okay, it's a party. <laughs> it's a party. Please come see us. And one more question before I let the two of you go. I know sure. something everyone besides the music, they're really looking forward to, the dances. Are we going to see some iconic dances in this oh, musical? I mean, Please tell me yes. I don't think there isn't anything that we miss in this show yet. Yeah, yeah, it's a lot of dancing. Oh, good. Uh, everyone good. is dancing down from MJ all the way to the ensemble. It's, mm -hmm. it's, it's marvelous. So just mm -hmm. come through and... and, uh, and Party with us. Yeah. Have a good time. You're yeah. gonna have a great time. Yeah. We, can, we can promise that. <laughs> I like that. He made that promise here on Live in the Bay, and I know it. Uh -oh. I'm, I'm gonna believe that. <laughs> Josh, Jamal, thank you both so much pleasure. for joining thank us you today. So much for having it's us. Such a pleasure. If you want to learn more or to get your tickets for MJ the Musical, just head on over to our website at liveinthebay.tv.